Thank you. Uh, what does everyone here think of Helen Keller jokes? <laughs> yeah, her sense of humour is not really for me either. <laughs> uh, I was recently abroad and came across quite a large number of Americans. So, so I did the same thing I always do when I come across quite a large number of Americans abroad, which is try to obscure the fact I'm a New Zealander. Uh, because their reaction is invariably the same. As soon as they find out where you're from, they'll go, they'll go like this. They go, oh, oh my God! Oh, wow! <laughs> New Zealand? Oh, no way! You know, I've always wanted to go, but it's just so far! <laughs> oh, yes? <laughs> That's curious, as we're both in Marrakesh. <laughs> you know, you know my brother Kyle, he went down there three years ago. He said it was beautiful. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> uh, well, well, my younger sister, uh, Annie, works as a business analyst. for a finance company, so. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, no, I'm sorry, I seem to be confused. Uh, I thought we were exchanging trivial pieces of information <laughs> about our siblings. <laughs> I uh, flew here on a plane, the normal way. I love flying. My favourite thing about flying is landing. <laughs> and then you taxi to the terminal and uh, the, the, the chief steward will come on and they'll say, uh, they'll say uh, the seatbelt sign is now off. And everyone on the plane will go, oh, well, that's perfect. I'm going to be the first off this flight. And I'm sitting there thinking, no, we're 37 rows back. <laughs> you're in a window seat. There is no planet in which you're going to be the first off this flight. <laughs> but everyone's sort of too embarrassed to sit back down, so they, <laughs> they try to play it off. They go, oh, oh no, well, well, no, this is how I always stand, actually. I, uh, <laughs> I quite like it here. 45 degrees this is my angle. So. <laughs> Fair enough. It's a pretty good angle. My angle, quite horny. <laughs> I, I love the idea of sex. Like, I think ever since high school, you know, it was my big goal in high school, my big through line in high school, it seemed very important at the time, was to have sex. So I'm confident the rules are the same everywhere. Whereby, if you don't have sex in high school, you don't get to have sex at all. <laughs> and, and that's a harsh rule, yes. But I think it's important we continue to police it to this day. You know, take me, for example. You know, I'm 30 years old and absolutely busting to fuck. But <laughs> rules are rules. Thank you so much, everybody. I'm Guy Montgomery.